welcome back to another video. I am Slip. I am Stash. You are watching Two Piece and a Biscuit. Two Piece and a Biscuit? Cody, what do you do with those pinkies? I put them in the biscuit. That's what I'm talking about. Today we've got Soundgarden, Slays and Bulldozers, live at Pink, at Pop. Pink Pop. This was a uh, this is a request from our girl Amy. Shout out to Amy. She, she fucking requests fucking everything. She requested this for the song itself for a while and this version. And then yeah. she said, because I think originally she requested us to, when we did Slaves and Bulldozers, to do this version, but we did this and now we're doing the album. So she said, since we've already heard it, might as well watch the live. Might as well watch the live. It looks like, like we did on the last, like we, we did, did on Outshine. And this looks Which I, th I think is a great idea. If we've already heard it, we should do a live version of yeah, it. Yeah, I think I think You know what works. I mean? It's like when we go back and do the. The other albums that's when we do Nirvana and stuff like that, we, we should do, do, do uh, ten. Yeah, do the ten when we do albums. ten, we'll do we'll do the live versions of them. And most of the, the ten albums on unplugged. If we wanted to watch it on fucking, well, most of it is, but I mean, I don't we think don't have to do it on there. there. No, I don't really think releases really on there. But, but but some of the first times that you've heard those songs, you've heard the live song or the live album like or black, the live versions of it already. Porch. Yeah, black and blue. We can do another version. Another version, whatever. Yeah, that's a good. I like that idea because it's better than us just sitting here just kind of like listening to it because we've heard it. I wish we'd have done that on. On, on uh, Rusty Cage? On Rusty Cage, yeah. yeah. I didn't think about it. Yeah, I didn't either. That's all right, but here we are now. We yeah. can't go back in time. Yeah, no, so. we can't. All right, so we're doing Slaves and Bulldogs. Well, I mean, we can make another video and act like we never I made mean, that we one. We could. If we but, really we, to. but it wouldn't be as good because you guys got biscuited during that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when you, you show up. You got Celine Dion. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when you show up to two pieces of the biscuit. You never know what the fuck you're gonna get. No, you know when they, when they're watching that. Amy popped up that video. She's like, they're not reacting to Celine Dion. She knew damn good and well that they're doing Celine Dion. It's all right. It's all right. I want. I can't wait to see reactions on it. You guys, if you guys liked our April Fool joke, hit us up down in the comments on our April Fool Day. And let us know what you thought. That's I thought funny. it was a pretty good idea. I thought it was kind of funny. Yeah, I thought it was cool. funny. I thought it was. Hilarious. Oh yeah, we, we, Cody we, couldn't stop laughing. We have a Trojanator Double Bock beer, so I've never had this. So well, this is eight good. and a half percent. Me and Cody are going to be toasted before Slaves and Bulldozers is over. It should be because this is like an eleven-minute song. It's a seven-minute song, but since it's live, I guess it probably it looks like he's that. Oh yeah, he's, he's laying on the ground shit. playing with his wiener and shit. I'm just looking. I was seeing the freshness date on it to see how recent. 7, 12, 21. Yeah, not bad. So it's All like, right. Yeah, cool. Good. All right. All right. 7, 12, 21. Oh, that's when it's, that's so, when it's um, not good anymore. June. Yeah, April, June. So July 21st or 7, July 12th, yeah. Three that's when it goes bad? That's when it's supposed to be. The, that's that's when it's supposed to be, like, not the freshest anymore. Hmm. I wonder how long it's been sitting there. That's usually, like, some people will do that. They'll look and see when the fresh date is, the further away it is, it's, of course, you know. Right. But the longer it sits, the more fermented it gets. Right. It's like a bottle of wine. It's like a bottle of Dave. I think me and Dave should make our own wine. It's like semen. It just starts clabbering if you don't yeah, jerk off enough. Stuff. You know that, right? Oh, you need to start jerking off more. It's going to look like cottage cheese coming out of your wiener Ooh. if you don't. That's chunky. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that's, I'm saying. that's chunky. Yeah. All right, but yeah, so. All right, Choconator. Cheers. Cheers. Prost! Prost for our German Prost folks. For our there. German bastards. That's actually pretty tasty. It's really smooth. Yeah. For an 8% beer. Oh, God. That shit, that, 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 this is the type of shit that gets you in trouble. I was going to say, that's going to get me in trouble. That's the type of shit. That's like when you get shots of something or any type of drink that you can drink that doesn't taste like alcohol. That's when right. you know you're about to have like a those fucking, Like those fucking strawberry reds my wife has in here. Have you ever had one of those? Strawberry reds. Yeah. You ever had a Reds? Yeah, I've had a Reds, but I don't think I've had the straw. Oh. <laughs> Pause them real quick. Here, Cody. Yeah, I've never had a strawberry one. I have a taste of that motherfucker. Watch strawberry. that Strawberry. Watch that shit. Watch me just your... chug it. Dude. If you don't, I'm going to be disappointed. Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah. Right? It tastes it's like, like fucking... candy in a bottle. That's bad. Like, it's bad, like, as in, like... It's fucking A. Hold on. I'm looking at these glasses. We'll split that. Cause... That's, that's, that's dangerous. It's just fucking delicious. And this, shit, this shit's good till August. It's delicious. Holy crap. I mean, I've had reds. I, like, I like that better than, like, normal reds. Like, just they got straight... blueberry, peach. I think I've had... Have I had blueberry? I've just never had the strawberry. That's dangerous. Yeah. I mean, I know there's only like five percent alcohol in like but a still, red. Still, I mean, still. you drink a six pack of these motherfuckers. What are you doing? I have them down and like, yeah, that's the type of shit I sit there and. That's why I like sometimes my beer here a little bit too strong because I, I I won't sit and chug them down. I'll, you know, so I'll after I gave you that strawberry, did we just become best friends? 
Did, oh, did we just become best friends? We did. I think so. Good God. You can give that to me. I couldn't wait and tell you that, there's, that that's alcohol. Right. That is, but that's... It's fucking amazing, ain't it? That's fucking Get your girl, right That's there. what you do, man. You go home right now. Whew. When you go home tonight. Yeah. You get a 12-pack of that shit. Just pour it in a glass for your girl and be like, hey, I got you some... Uh, some apple juice. Some sparkling strawberry. Yeah, some sparkling strawberry. It's like, it's like, it's like apple juice. Yeah. You give go. her like six of them. She'll be like, man, I feel kind of weird. I feel kind of weird. Yeah, let's go upstairs. I'm going to I'm gonna get you in the biscuit. I'm going to... I'm going to get you in the she biscuit She loves when tonight. I put the pinky in her biscuit. And it's not going with the pinky. Alright, right, Slays and Bulldozers live. We're fucking uh, around drinking strawberry I know, oil and like, carbonator. I, mean, I figure, you know, Dave's not usually a fruity drinking kind of guy, but this shit's fucking good. Like I said, it's like juice. Holy crap, it's like juice. Because Dave usually drinks, eh? This is, yeah. Milwaukee's best ice. Yeah. Cool. Crisp. Refreshing. Refreshing. Alright. Slays and Bulldozers, like, comment, subscribe, check out the Instagram, check out the Discord if you want to chat with us. This is what horrible fucking nannies give kids at night. <laughs> Just put it in their bottle. Just put it in their bottle. There you go. Here's a sippy cup. Now the parents asked, how did the baby sleep last night? How, how did... <laughs> like a fucking rock. Like a fucking rock. He's fine. He might be an alcoholic, but he's a rock. That baby's going He's hitting up your liquor cabinet tonight, <laughs> but he slept good. I watched that baby take the take a red... We had a red strawberry in the fridge. He popped that shit out of there. I watched that motherfucker open it up and drink it. <laughs> he down the whole damn thing. Less than a little quicker than I could. Okay, let's do it. God, horrible nannies. Terrible nannies. <sighs> That's going to be another segment. Stash the nanny. <laughs> no, it's not going to be. We're going to make skits of Stash being a nanny. <laughs> I don't know who the baby's going to be. It's going to be you. Or am I going to dress up as a big old... like In like, a diaper. I'll do it, too. And I'll kick you in the face. I mean, well, so, I mean, you're going to anyway when you're T-Ranny. T- yeah? Yeah. So. T-Ranny. I need some cough syrup in my soft syrup. Cough syrup in my soft syrup. God, look at, look at all those fucking people, dude. Fucking crazy. Right? That's your monitor board back there. That's, like, where all the sound's done. Okay. But, I mean, you could, dude, like, right. fucking, that's like, ridiculous. That's crazy. Whoo! And he's just laying on the ground. You know they just got done with another song. Right. And he's like, oh, we're just, just going to lead into this. So you probably finish like that and start. I'm going to hide down here behind the monitor so right. nobody sees so me. So nobody sees me. Yeah. I'm not on stage anymore, guys. You can't see me. I disappeared. Me. I like the quality of this video. Yeah, it looks good. It looks really good. Really good. I'm not really sure why, but all the fucking overseas places mm -hmm. get, like, the absolute best concerts ever. Yeah. Like, Download Festival is overseas. Yeah. Like, that's, like, three days of fucking just ridiculous madness. I would love it. That's that's the one we saw the Slipknot the Slipknot, was Download. Yeah. Yeah. Download, yeah. Dude, it's fucking stupid. Like, you can go to, like, just look up Download yeah. and look up bands that have been on Download. Fucking stupid. One of these just, days when me and Dave can quit our jobs. Yeah, we're going to quit our... You guys, you guys keep subscribing to this channel. Me and Cody are going to quit our jobs. Say fuck our jobs. We don't need money, and we're gonna we're gonna fly to Austria, or no? Where is pay, where is download? I think downloads in Germany. Might be. That's, I think I think that's right. There we go. I think that's right. We're gonna come see you, German bastards. Fuck yeah! Huh. Hey, Rockstein's gonna be in Chicago this year. Let's go. I really want to. That's not too far. I think it's that's only, that's not I that mean, far of a drive. That's like three hundred dollars, four hundred dollars a ticket plus. It's all right. <laughs> It'd be <laughs> worth it. You're cashing out, right? <laughs> I'm paying for both of them. got the stimmy. Amy says she got me. Amy, <laughs> Amy says she got us both, if right? All, if every person that watches our Rammstein video just gives us a dollar, we'll, we'll go. We'll go. They're not watching this, probably. No. Nope. We'll have to say that in the next Rammstein. Yep, if, they all, if they all give us a dollar, we'll go to our Rammstein concert. Yeah, we'll go We'll go see Rammstein, <laughs> and then we'll, we'll, we'll vlog the whole thing. All right, yep, we'll do yep. it. Okay, <laughs> we're, we got to mention that. Okay, we will. Mental note, mention that. Got it. 
God, man. Candy in a jar, in a bottle, or whatever. Right? It's just candy in a glass. It's fucking so good. What I say. Yes. Raining. Man, he's all the way down his feet. <laughs> oh, yeah. Honestly, that's how he plays a lot of the time. That's crazy. This sounds almost exactly like the studio version. It sounds so good. Oh my god. It's even better live. That's great. Oh my god. Once Okay. I thought he was about to belt that shit for a minute and he didn't. It caught me off guard. I was like, okay, okay. That's why sometimes I like live versions and because they'll change up, you know, yeah, how they sing some shit. Get, I like it. You get a little, you a little get, different, you know. And you'll get a lot of, you get a, like, like the band will actually show you what they can do, right? And it, so that it's, that's another thing that makes it cool. Like right. I've seen so many shows at concerts and been like, "Oh, this is where they're about to go," right? And they nope. go, right? Which nope. is, that's why I think I don't know, live verses are just cool. So sometimes yeah. they'll cut like in the middle of a song and go into a completely other song. Like when I saw Prince, dude, it was like he did like five songs in a row, right? But they were all together. Like he'd do like a piece of Little Red Corvette and then hop into something else and then hop into Raspberry Beret and then hop into something else. We need else. to do some prints. Yeah, we need to do some more prints. Like, we need to hit Purple Rain, like, very Purple soon. Rain. Like, live. We'll do it. I mean, maybe not. I mean, like I said, I know we got, it can be something we toss in because, you know, yeah. whatever, you know. But we will. Yeah, I know we got a lot of shit we want to toss in. But yeah. I just want to say that I thought he was, like, you know, about to go there and he did, but it don't matter. It's still good. Woo! Yeah! Fucking raining on them bitches, too. That guy tried. Oh, yeah, he tried. She is super butchy. I was about to say, you know, they look She like, is a super butch. They didn't look like they were enjoying themselves. No, they she didn't. is super butch. I mean, she's like, where is Liz Farr right now? <laughs> I thought. I we, thought this is a Celine Dion concert. <laughs> no, no, no. She is not the Celine Dion type. No. <laughs> I, she is. She is. They had a. They had one that was like an all women's. Yeah. Lesbian thing. Okay. Yeah, that's that's where she thought she was. Okay. Like she thought she was chilling there with Liz Farr and 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 Annie Lennox and They just they they look like they don't know who Soundgarden is. Right, yeah. She, she looks angry. Yeah. Like, and this girl, this girl here and the, the right next to her with her hood up, she looks like she don't even know what she's doing either. They that, look, they that's look, her girlfriend. They look young. Yeah, they do. All these people look she, young. She she looks like she might be old enough to smoke cigarettes. Right. And she probably has just to look cool. That, that leather jacket's brand new. She's a poser. That le- if you're going to wear a leather jacket to a concert, it better be worn. Right. Amy, if I'm wrong, let me know. But this chick right here, it's it, it's like watching Sesame Street. One of these things is not like the, the other. other yeah. You know what I mean? Look at the rest of these people in the crowd. They got tore up shit. This bitch had aired a brand new leather jacket. It's her jacket. first concert, probably. Yeah. She's just, and she's like front fucking row, too. I think right. she's right out of the fucking front. But she is not happy. At a Soundgarden concert, it doesn't even look like she's not happy. She's just... Yeah. No, I'd be going nuts. I don't even think she's... I don't even think she's not in her head. Go play it. Look. She was watching. 
Barely, still a bit. <laughs> I'd be fucking. He's he's giving his all right now too. For real. She's just like. Who's Chris Cornell? That's what she's saying. Who's this guy? That crowd, man, that's what I'm saying. I can imagine performing for a crowd like that. See, they're getting into it. That guy's back there. They're all into it. it. See, you can always tell true fans too, like right. real fans, because yeah. they're going to be, they're going to try to push them themselves all the way up to the front. They don't give a shit if they're dry. Right. They don't give a shit if they're walking in mud right. the entire yeah, time. Right. Like everybody else in the back with their fucking umbrellas. Yeah. They're a bunch of pussies. I don't give a fuck now. These people up front, you don't see one goddamn umbre- umbrella up front. Even with the These, fake poser girl, she did. Well, fake have poser girl. Yeah, fake poser lesbian butch girl yeah. doesn't even care. And I have no problem with lesbians, I love y'all. But she she has no problem whatsoever with being out there in her in her fake ass brand new. The rest of the hell out of this shit. Yeah. I don't know who you are, and if you're watching this. It's video, actually Amy now. No, it's no. not Amy. <laughs> she, it's not Amy. Sorry, Amy. Amy. I, I know, you. I know Amy's prettier than that. But this chick she, she's she's true to music. There's somebody there that she's waiting to see. Right. She pushed her way up front just to see somebody. Right. I can you know what say, I mean? Yeah. It, it is, Might not be Soundgarden, it's but it's probably somebody. Natalie Merchant and 10,000 Maniacs. Yeah. But I'm just saying, these, these guys up front, if you watch that crowd, like the whole front of the crowd that goes yeah. around like this, yeah. hey, one of them got a goddamn umbrella, Mm-mm. but everybody in the back's like posers. Right. Fucking posers. I would have loved to have been there, though. Man. Separate the posers. The real from the fakes. The real from the fakes. Man. And the snakes. Snakes. That's a two-piece. Serpent piece boy. And a biscuit. Check out our... Uh, Head P.E. P.E. Serpent boy. Check it. Loving this. Me too. That dude's a meth head and a half. I gotta quit making fun of the crowd, people. About to go way off the rails here. Mm Mm-hmm. Yeah. He's rocking that guitar, too, though. They're just off the rails right now. They're just doing whatever they want. Yeah, yeah, I love it too. They're jamming. Kim's like, oh, what was this song, Seven Minutes? <laughs> Let's drag this bitch out a little bit. Right. How about it? He's about to start belting some shit, man. Yeah, there we go. He's playing with feedback. Yeah. When they take the guitar and they face it towards the actual amps themselves, like the speakers, yeah. they'll give them feedback. That's where they're getting all that rain. Oh, That's where he's okay. getting that rain, oh, that okay. high from. That's cool. Okay. And he's walking by and smacking it again with oh, his mouth. Oh, okay. And then putting it back up against the speakers okay. and pulling that That's feedback. That's cool. I was wondering. That's cool.
You hear that a lot in... What the fuck's he singing now? This ain't the same song, is it? This ain't part of Slaves and Borders, is it? No. What the That's fuck? A door is... song. A door song? The Doors? No, oh, the Doors. Jim okay. Morrison. Okay, I've heard of the Doors. That's that's one so of their songs. So he's just singing. So he just kind of adds some he's, shit. Yeah, he's, they're ad libbing. Okay. They're ad libbing and throwing another one of their that's, favorite songs into that's it. Fucking and then dope. Their, yeah. This is dope. That's, that's cool. what they do. All right, so you don't know the Doors? I, I not really. No, I think oh. like I've heard of the Doors. Holy but... fucking shit! <laughs> Holy fucking shit! Oh, shit. All right. We're gonna do some doors soon. I'm excited. Holy fuck! Okay. Who's ever heard the doors? As far as I know. Jim Morrison got in trouble. He got arrested for fucking yanking his wiener out on stage in front of a whole bunch of girls. He got like literally arrested. Just like he was just like. As long as he didn't put on them. Here, here it is. Check it out. As long as he didn't R. Kelly on. Threw his shit straight out. No, he didn't. He didn't pee on anybody. That's good. Though. Uh, yeah. That's good. Don't be on 15 year olds. Let me turn your face into a toilet seat. <laughs> I want to piss on it. I like this little bonus we're getting at the end. <laughs> this is the middle. And that's one of those great things about going to shows is they ad lib shit like that. You know right. what I mean? Sometimes you hear stuff. I heard, uh, I saw um, The Used and My Chemical Romance. I don't know if you know either one. I know who My Chemical it. Romance is. Okay. Uh, I saw both of them do Under Pressure by Queen and Under David Bowie. Pressure. Yep. Yeah, they, yeah they, they came out and played that shit together. Okay, that's dope. Like, it was dope. It was cool as fuck. Cool. Like, wasn't expected. Yeah. Because My Chemical played first, then they used finished the, the night off, mm -hmm. and then My Chemical came back out and played that song. Right, okay, which cool. Which is cool as fuck. That's dope, that is. It's cool. I don't like this. That's just what they did in the 90s, Dave. I'm tired of it. I know they did. I watched TV all the fucking time when I was in that. That's just a 90s thing. <clears throat> they thought it was cool. They did it for the first time. I'm like, oh, that's cool. He needs to tie his shoes. That'd be me. I don't tie my shoes. Now, balloons I don't tie anymore, but all the rest of them I do. Making love to that bass yeah, right now. He's he 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 just dry humping yes, that thing until it fucking makes noise. They're just having fun, man. Yeah, I love it. That's why I love it. The band is just having man. fun. He's like, all right, y'all just want to have fun. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have some fun myself. And he is dragging that bass around stage. I don't know. But how. realize he is keeping beat yeah. the entire time. Like, has not like lost that. the beat no. the whole time. Because it's up to the drummer and the bass player to, to keep, keep that beat and keep that, that flow going all the time. He ain't lost it at all. Which is, I, could, I, mean, I mean, that's just how you play. That's how you play. That's like I talk about Tom Morello plays way up here. I mean, if you play way down low, and that's just how you like to play. Right. I don't think I could be hunched over playing like that. My back would be killing me. Normally, most bass players that I've seen play either medium 
Or Les Claypool plays up high. Really? Like, really high. Like, okay. and, and he does, like, this kick thing. We need to do some Primus. But, okay. yeah, this this is fucking, dude, this dude's fucking nuts. Because, I mean, how much control can you actually have over it? You know what I mean? Well, like, he, while you're hanging down like this, you got the strap hanging mm-hmm. over. It's swinging all over the place. How much control can you actually have in that base but still be able see, to keep yeah. that time the whole time? Dude, he's fucking insane. That's when you know you're a true professional. He's amazing. And I don't know if it's just me, but I don't think it, uh, it doesn't seem like we've been watching this for nine minutes. No. Now back in the slave mode. Is that Dave Mustaine? It looks like Dave Mustaine. With his hair hanging out of his face. Yeah. From Megadeth? Yeah, I, I know who he is. Oh, look at you! I know who he is. Proud of you, Cody. Oh, proud of you, Cody. He's just going nuts! I know why. That's all I want to be. Yeah. Okay. Hear that? Yep, I hear. That's fucking cool, though. And your favorite. Pink pop. All right, I think they did that one too many times. The first time, it's all right. Yeah, um, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, the, you do it once during the show, that's fine. But, I mean, it was an 11-minute song, so I guess yeah. they were trying to... You know, Advertise. That, was, that was a fucking great... That was great, fun. That was a great video. That was a great... Great suggestion on that one, Amy. Yeah, that yeah. One. I, I love that, that little intro into the doors. Yeah, we got to hit some doors up, man. Those yeah. guys are so fucking amazing. Just see what Jesus I like Johnny, Johnny Knoxville hitting wings. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I just so I almost made forget that why we were doing it was because of the album. <laughs> yeah. I was just having fun. That, that was no, something was... I would have loved to do as a separate reaction in general. Like, right. I've done that anyway. Well, I mean, we've already done the original, so, I mean, and Amy suggested this. She wanted to see but it. But now we're about to start getting into... Uh, it's fucking amazing. Now we're about to pull on to the next song. Songs that... Uh, Let's keep going. All kinds of songs I haven't heard yet, so... Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cody hasn't heard anything past this. Nope, those are the only, three, the Soundgarden only three Soundgarden songs he's heard. So besides a couple, oh my god, I cannot wait to get to Drawing Flies. Okay, Drawing Flies is my favorite. Somebody yeah. else. Uh, there's been a couple people in that suggestion. You need to draw fly, Drawing Flies. Flies. You need to do Drawing Flies. Drawing Flies is my favorite because it starts with. You remember that little fucking C and say that you used to have? It was like a big circle with the arrow in the middle yep. of it, and you pulled it. And it says the cow says boo. Yeah, 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 yeah. It starts like that. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah cool. It's fucking dope, dude. Okay. So yeah, so hopefully good. you guys um, enjoyed. If you did, I'm sure Amy enjoyed that. And uh, uh, I mean, even Nato's probably here. Shout out to you, Nato. I'm trying to give you some love too. You commented about the slaves yeah. and bulldozers before. Yes, you did. And we're sorry for not uh, not throwing you into it. So. We're my bad. Like, I uh, did. We, yeah. we get so many people, so much shit going on in life. We're, we're sorry. We're, I'm going to start writing people's I names down in my fucking book yeah, and remembering people. But so. shout out to you because I'm sure you're probably here watching this. And probably, I mean, I don't know if you'll watch the whole album, but I'm sure if you like Slaves and Bulldozers, you probably enjoy Soundgarden. Yep, and we're going to throw, the, we're, Big Nato, we're about to throw some Big fucking Nato. more rage in here. Yeah, we, we just, yeah. he commented on the one, uh, one day as a lion. Yeah. So, yeah, which I knew he would be there for yeah. that because he likes rage. That's where, I think that's where he first found us, I think. So. Yep. Yeah. We definitely gotta get back into some more rage, and we still gotta finish the last like two songs off the one day as a line. There's like two more, three more no, songs from that. There's little... four. Two more songs. Right. There's five, five on the album. We so, only did one. No, we did two. We did Wild International. We did another one when I was here the other day. Oh, did we? We did um. One day as a line. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we did the first two. Okay. 
Wow. When we got together the other... When, when, I was drunk. Last Thursday. I was drunk. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys. But yeah, so if you guys enjoy, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to check out uh, Stash's Instagram for all of his art. Check out ours if you just want to see some random shit that has to do with the channel. Hit up our Twitter. Check Hit up Twitter. our Discord. Yep. We are two pieces of biscuit. Deuces. Deuces.